assalamu alaikum to everyone in this uh, nginx tutorial today we will see some redirect rules of nginx so uh, let's start so what is nginx uh, redirect rule as the meaning of the word redirect so it's right our uh, request to another uh, uh, url that means uh, if you are searching for uh, anything it will uh, uh, rewrite your url and it will redirect you to another uh, url okay that's it uh, so let's see uh, uh, what uh, it says ability to sense rewrite incoming url into a different url based on a, your criteria is an essential feature for any web server so why it is essential uh, so let's see the uh, uh, syntax first your syntax is we have to use the rewrite word and we have to use some rejex as you uh, uh, i think you are familiar with some rejex syntaxes and what we should replace okay and the flag so what is exactly rewrite does in our in the server so if you are uh, like searching for something without changing your url main url it will serve you uh, a, a, a another content okay under the hood you will not see this actually so uh, uh, as i am showing you the uh, demonstration like you are uh, asking for index.html and in this web server we will find that index.html is available or not based on that if it's not available or something some uh, logic can be uh, either it is available also you will serve from the new html file okay but you will see you are uh, you are seeing exactly in this HTML, but this is not the fact okay and then the server sensing or rewriting your url uh, under the hood on the fly so let's see some example and use cases uh, in our in the server as you can see i have some i have expression uh, i have a syntax of rewrite uh, i i will give you some example with uh, some uh, bash scripting uh, language or is using rejects this means suppose this caret sign means the start of the url or beginning of the uh, url slash okay so after slash it will find some data call what data and then anything okay. and then again click and then any word that means you have to have in your uh, url data anything geek anything and then this means the end of the url okay so here can be some query parameters and then it will replace with uh, this this one this means a, a data will be put here and it will be linux and this dollar two sign that means uh, that this one geek okay so ultimate url will be data slash linux slash geek uh, dot html and this last flag means it will stop processing any other rewrite rules okay but but it, it depends on where it is it is uh, using this flag in between a location block or outside a location block and here another flag called break we'll see them uh, step by step okay so now let's go to the another example as you can see it is also the similar one here is this, some uh, static uh, uh, rejex sample and here is the linux word and here a dot okay and here can be anything and this is the last uh, indicating the end of the url okay so it will divert us to the uh, linux.psp slash distro and here here uh, whatever you are putting inside this it will be available it will be re rewrite here okay so it will it will divert us to linux.psp plus distro is equal to this file extension we'll see in our lab section in every example okay 
so this is the same one i think okay so now here is the example of brick so whenever it will find some this kind of i i think i have explained this rewrite syntax uh, here is some data and missing word geek and missing word it will be replaced by this here here that is data linux geek dot html and it will break that means it will stop processing okay and it will return 403 so let's see this break or last flux and uh, uh, explain all these things what will our result okay so as you can see it is my server uh, context here is some location block it's just location slash notes and documents and here is some rewrite okay so if i here is server name and okay a root path okay some somewhere it can be now if i call example.com slash text.txt slash text look slash text okay so here it, it, it will not find anything but when it will come the start of the you uh, slash okay and it will find dot txt okay anything dot plus txt it's it's, it's actually a resource expression and as you can see the txt we have so it will exactly match this one got it and slash notes uh, txt okay it, it will match this this first bracket means the uh, word okay so it will match this text dot test dot txt and it will rewrite this slash notes and dot text notes slash text notes slash text so it will come back to this line and again it will look that that is this the notes the uh, word and slash it will find the test uh, test dot txt okay it will find here test dot txt and it will relate to us to the documents plus uh, something that means documents plus share could be oh, it will it will come exactly here but let's see what this dollar one means this means the this one okay so here anything will be there it will be there okay so these documents it will look for documents it will come here and it will return an echo got it it will return an echo for us so it probably this dollar will be not txt text test okay it will be test so that's it this is a no break or last example it will go for another rewrite rule rewrite rule rewrite rule okay it will look every rewrite rule and uh, execute them so the next example is outside location block break or last so as you can see we have some break or last anything so the similar example and now this time if we call this test or tst it will immediately stop here and here as we have notes slash test then it will come here and it will match this one finally match location notes so this one no more parsing or rewrite condition and this internal engine goes to the next phase searching for location mass okay so it will come here now the third example is inside location block break so again it come here so we don't have any it's a default route okay so it will come here finally mass location slash then it will rewrite the test.txt node slash it will come here and it will have its break that means it will stop uh, going anything and as it is inside the location block it uh, it is a location block it will immediately 
break but if we have we had their last okay it should find another notes and another uh, location okay so let's see inside a location block break flag would do the following no more passing or rewrite condition and then it's internal and then continues to pass to the current location block so as it's break it will immediately stop here take a say it will not go far so it its result will be finally must last location this one nothing else okay So we will see the last example and we will have some similar uh, inside location block last similar example but what happened it will find the last one last rewrite rule it will come here and then it will not stop okay and it will look for the next one and it will come here okay and then that's why it will execute okay my bad it will also stop there but it will go come here as it is last this is the difference between this break and this uh, last okay break will immediately stop here but last will follow its uh, execution it will go to the next location it will find the next location notes okay so let's have a summary when you rewrite condition it's a little bit confusing when you are uh, configuring you don't have to memorize things okay you will just put these things and test out okay find it's working then if not work then put the other thing and grab your desired configuration that's it you don't have to remember all these things man okay when a rewrite condition with a flag break or last message and then stop parsing any more rewrites outside a location block will with break or last and then it does the same job it's just a stop inside a location block with break and it stop processing any more rewrites. every every last and break flag stopping processing rewrite conditions but inside a location block with the last and it stop processing any more rewrite condition and then it starts to look for a new missing location look not processing any rewrite but looking for location so rewrite means rewrite is diverting arts to any location so last means it, it is stopping but it will look for this location and break means it's rapidly break here nothing else so this is uh, uh, the presentation on nginx location directory rewrite directive actually okay and in my previous tutorials i have shown tcp http load balancing nginx architecture and uh, location directive so next video we will see rewrite lab section and i hope i will explain some um, stream processing uh, tutorials also so thank you for uh, watching my videos